He speaks to the small mouth. His boat is a small mouth Disneyland, and he is this week's guest. He is Bassmaster Elite Series champion, Takumi Ito. I'm Bob Cobb for the Bassmaster. Welcome to Mercer. Welcome one, welcome all. I thank you for tuning in to Mercer, the Awkwardly Honest Fishing Podcast. And week after week, we bring you these podcasts. And, and here's my promise to you right now. This week's podcast will be better than the one that I did last week. All right? I mean, that's all you can shoot for is to be better than you were the time before. But this week's podcast will definitely be better than the one that I put out last week. Okay, so we're going to move forward and we're going to jump right into this because this week's podcast is a very, very special one, but we start them all with looking at what special days you're celebrating. I thank you for celebrating Hump Day with me. I welcome all the humpers that tune in week after week. It is National Junk Food Day. It is National Hot Dog Day. And it is National Be Someone Day, which is kind of fitting because I like junk food and hot food dogs and our guest really is someone and did something and I honestly believe this I mean there's been so much going on in the fishing world and we'll talk about that as the podcast moves on week after week I mean so many great things going on the last few weeks in the Bassmaster Elite Series but something really special happened this past weekend and it's not something anybody at the Elite Series is shocked about because we all get to see it all the time but it's like the rest of the fishing world fell in love with Takumi Ito. And that character you see on stage, that character you see on the water, it's the same guy you see every single time you see him. Whether it be first thing in the morning, whether it be the end of the night. I mean, he is an individual that I've literally never seen grumpy i mean i'm sure he has bad days but i and i'm not talking when you're standing talking to him i'm talking about like when i look out of my hotel and we're staying in the same hotel and i look down and he is rigging rods he looks happy he is living his dream and i'm going to tell you today's podcast is going to be a different one but if you're somebody who wants to chase a dream if you're somebody who's been told you can't do something you need to listen to today's podcast because this guy has overcome so much. And even just the simple stuff like, I mean, his communication barriers. English is a second language. And that entire live crowd fed off him like he was the greatest communicator they've ever seen. I mean, what he does by just being real and being honest is amazing. He is Takumi Ito. He is this week's guest. And he is a Bassmaster Elite Series champion. Good morning, Takumi. I see you there with your trophy. Good morning, Ben. Yes, I big food trophy. <laughs> how many, how much time have you spent looking at the trophy since you got it? Uh, Staring at it. So, walking, looking? Have, yes. Have, uh, many times, <laughs> many times, yeah, very, very heavy trophy, many times. Does, have you talked to people at home? Have you talked to people at Japan? What what kind of excitement have yeah, you heard? Yeah, so many Japanese people love Bassmaster, so Bassmaster indeed, so many watching the Bassmaster live, so many Japanese people excited. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, social media is a so very, very happy, but very, very busy. So I'm very good time now. So what have you done? What what did you do after you won? You know, obviously you won, you got the trophy, you had the moment on the stage. And then last time I saw you, you were surrounded by people waiting for your autograph. What what have you done between now and then? What, do you, uh, what, what did you do you, after? What did you do that night after you won? Oh yes, yeah, so Bassmaster Elite Tournament. So it's my 
big dream. If I won, if I won, so always, so I want to win the Bassmaster Elite, but now I won, so I'm very, very happy. And next, next dream, I want to win the Bassmaster Classic <laughs> and the AOY. Yeah, so it is tournament I won, so I uh, so so I can't believe now, but I won. So my dream, so elite is my dream. So every I I hope every year so fishing the elite. So next next dream is a uh, yeah I want I I want to win the classic Bassmaster Classic. But but I think the classic trophy is even heavier. It's oh, really? even heavier than the, that one. Yeah. How are you going to lift it? You got to start <laughs> no. lifting weights. No. So I need uh, so many <laughs> stretches. So I I need uh, so I, I know I don't have a power, so I cannot hold only one. I need a save help. <laughs> so save help. I can hold. Now, tackle only. I cannot. I can hold. But now you have a trophy, so yeah. you can train every night. If you do ten of those oh, every night, no, no, no. maybe, <laughs> maybe broken. So I, I always carry carefully carry, but no up, down, throw. So because. I'm small and I have no power. I, I cannot. I cannot. Do you, is it a bit, now that you've won, not on a video game, the first time you won was on a video game when you were a little kid. How does this compare to winning on a video game? Uh, so video games so win. I'm seven years old. So Super, super Black Bus 2 video game name. So I, I so I go to the school. I went to school in uh, seven years old, and uh, go back house, and uh, every day game, and uh, get the bath. So and I won a uh, classic in the video game. So I'm very happy. Seven years old, but <laughs> but so I'm grow up ten years, eleven years, tw twelve years old. So. I want to go to the U.S. I want to go to the U.S. every 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 day. I thinking so. Ten years old, eleven years old, twelve years old. So three years ago, so I decide Bassmaster Open, Central Open, and uh, I fishing started three years ago in the U.S. So because I want to get uh, Bassmaster Elite Blue Trophy. So now, so 2019 started Central Open, Bassmaster Central Open. Now I got a Bassmaster Elite Blue Trophy. So I'm very happy. <laughs> three years, three years. So I'm so happy. Yeah. A dream come true. A dream come true. You beat, you beat if you look at the top 10 that day. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. You beat yeah, some yeah. of the best smallmouth bass anglers in the world. Both Johnstons, Brandon and, Paul, Nick, I mean, Austin yeah. Felix. I mean, you the list goes on and on. Clark Wendlet, like, you name it. They have so much experience there. How yeah. did you win? How did you beat them? And, and you had never fished for smallmouth before last year. Yeah, so many awesome angles. So Johnston Brothers is a super awesome. Brando is awesome. Clark. Austin, the many, many awesome anglers, so Bassmaster Elite, but maybe Taku, Taku, only Taku have no experience small mass. So only in the last year that my first small mass, so you I'm in US. But I think, I think my I use my Jap I use the Japanese bait. Japanese bait. So Japanese bait is uh, looks like different than uh, sand and uh, maybe 
taste. So small mouth uh, always eat a U.S. food. Small mouth <laughs> is a U.S. food. So by, by U.S. brand, U.S. Uh, US brand base. Yes. But, so maybe small mouth sometimes want to eat uh, Japanese scent, Japanese taste base. So I use, uh, I always use uh, many different Japanese base. So I always use, so looks like tasty. So, oh, let me see. And, yeah. So it looks like, oh man. So, so it looks like Japanese base. I turn, use, turn it I to use. the camera so we can see it there. Let me see. We'll very, very them out there. Let me see. Yeah. Them. It's a ricket. It's in a ricket. So very, very difficult. But so oh. yeah, all made into a rick liquid. My bait. So this bait, this bait on the hook balls. This bait. You leave them in the scent. Yeah. In the in the liquid to marinate. Liquid is a very very. And Japanese Japanese liquid, so bite bus liquid, liquid, so very very sense. So I, I'm not good, but small mass very very loud this scent. So I usually use, always use. I wanna use bait into the liquid one month, two months, three months, stay. Wow. Yeah, it's very, very important. And a very, very taku secret. Japanese scent, Japanese flavors, in tuna baits, small mass, if I burn small mass, all small mass coming up. And the bite. <laughs> it's very, very so crazy. I always watch the graph. I throw the bait. Many birds coming up, 20, 30 fish coming. Most of the big ones, the bite. So good. Can can I have some of Taku's special liquid? Can will, will you give me some? Oh, you are you are. Uh, uh, okay, okay. I will I will get more in Japan, but that's so very very difficult to get liquid. Yes. So I have only this one. Okay, do not give it to any other anglers on the Elite Series, okay? MCs, yes, okay. Yes, I TV got show it. hosts, they're okay. You yes. know, Zona, me, Davey, we're okay. Those <laughs> other guys, don't give them your top secret. Oh, yes, I got it. I, I will I will give Dave this liquid. <laughs> Maybe a little. A little bit, just a little <laughs> yeah, bit. A little, a little bit, yeah. So, but my bait is a... Different, all really fun grass. So, and the many kind of bait, shirouette, bait, bait size, sometimes small, sometimes weight change. So, 316, quarter, 1 8. It's a very, very important. Small mouth, sometimes very nervous. But I, so deep in the bait, deep in the bait, and the liquid, and the cast, one more bite. It's a very important. Yeah. On the last day, yeah. you said, and I've talked to your camera guy, Jake, mm -hmm. and, and, and he confirmed this. Um, you said that a hundred five pound smallmouth were below your boat. Is yeah. that real? Yeah. He says it is. So I can't believe that, but uh, so I I talk to Brandon. I talked to Brandon. So I say. So my spot, 105 pounder, but day one, day one, day two, day three, no 105 pounder, but day four, 105 pounder. So looks like lab, small mass lab, taku, all small mass come in my spot. I, I talked to Brandon Farnius. So Brandon said, maybe no swing, no swing is very important. So. My spot is a uh, two bay between the uh, point. Yeah. Shumo Bay and uh, I forget this name, so, but big bay. No swing coming. B 
bay, many five pounder in, into the spawning the bay, all coming up taku point, taku spot. So my my graph, I checked my graph, bottom here, 22, 27 feet, bottom here, 13 feet, all bass, 100. So, and the all big one. Bait come here, all bass. <laughs> <laughs> so, I can't believe that, but so day four, hundred small months. So good day. My oh. first time, my first, I have never seen this graph, 100 bus, but it's real. Wow. Wow. Magic, magic. It yeah. into life for you. Did you, when you went to come back, when you went to run in the river, when you left the lake, you left a lot of time. Did you think you had won the tournament or did you just think we've got enough weight? Let's go back. Uh, so, you... yeah. So if I fishing, so I can fishing maybe a couple of hours. So I have a time. Yeah. Only a two and a half fishing. So, but Lafford is a very, so fish, fish care is a, very very most important for me yes dead fish penalty and i love small mass. so i i don't i i i wanna i don't want uh, dead fish yeah so i'm slow driving and uh, care sometimes stop into the water the very very take care fish care is a very important so i drive not only fishing two and a third two and a half yeah, so, but maybe almost all five pounder. I caught a 26 pounder. Maybe the uh, max weight, I think, my spot. Yeah, you had, you had four, what do you have? Three five pounders, a six pounder, and a four pounder. Is that what you had? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three, maybe three six pounder, the two four pounder. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Incredible. Incredible. So, but I talked to, I told you, I talked to Jake, your camera guy. Yes. And he told me that the Taku's boat, Disneyland is not yes. Taku's boat anymore. You, you have to give the boat to Jake. Is this true? Are you giving yes. Jake your boat? You had a bet with Jake about the weight. What, what do you mean? Jake told me you guys had a bet and you said you had less than 26 pounds. He said mm -hmm. you had 26 pounds and if it was yes. less, you get yes. to keep his camera. But if it was 26 or more, he gets your boat. Yeah, so I, I think a 24 pound, 20, 23, 24, but Jake say 26 pound. You have a 26, you didn't have a 26 pound. But I don't think so. But I have a 26 pound. Incredible, yeah. incredible, incredible day. <laughs> you 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 to, to weigh in 26 pounds on that final day and to beat you know that field is is in is incredible but when did you said you started this dream when you were a little boy in japan so from a video game what kind of fishing did you grow up doing like what when how did you fish in japan uh so yes so i fish in uh, uh i so i play in a uh, video game, seven years old. So I got uh, many crappie, many pike, many bass, small mouth. And uh, so many kind of, I got a uh, fish in the video game, but in Japan, no pike, no crappie. Uh, I cannot get, but I try now. Uh, so same bait, so I try to uh, lure bait but I cannot get a bass in Japan, so I always got a uh, carp. <laughs> I always fish in a carp in a seven years old, eight years old, and so maybe nine, ten years old, my first bass I got, bass bait. But in Japan, it's a very, very difficult to so get a bass. 
So I always fish in a carp. How how many? So the so your carp fish in Japan and then bass fishing. But how many? A lot of your bass fishing was from shore, correct? Not in a boat. Yeah. So uh, now, so in Japan, it's a very very famous in the shore fishing. Shore. So because in Japan, the so very road is a very thin. So not 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 so. Always driving in U.S. Tundra, so Chevy is very easy because Big road trucks. is so wide. But yes. in Japan, the road is very thin. So bus boat is very big. It's very difficult. So many people enjoy the shore fishing. So I, I, me too. I so junior high school, high school. I enjoy the shore fishing. But I watch in a everyday bass master. Bass master is a, many other use a bass boat, skeeter boat, ranger, nitro, phoenix. So, so I watch in a, always watching the bass master. So I wanna get the bass boat. So, so my father fishing too, same. So maybe I'm 16 years old. My father go to a skeeter boat. Yeah, so together fishing. So now you now you're in a boat and able to yeah, fish. Yeah, yeah. So, and uh, in Japan, I'm a, so fishing media professional. Fishing media professional, photo shoot, video shoot, YouTube. So many kind of shooting in Japan. So, and uh, boat fishing bank fishing, so many kind of fishing, so every day in the Japan. But yes. my, my dream is a bass master. I want to try the bass master. I want to try the bass master wrong day, so I try it here. But go, uh, August go back to Japan, and uh, I many times so shooting, every day shooting in Japan. So do you think all of that, Fishing from shore in Japan. It, mm -hmm. When we saw what you did earlier in the year at Sabine River, mm -hmm. how you throw under the dock and you take so long to bring the bait back. <laughs> it, yeah. Did that knowledge is is that patience and that ability? Did that come from the shore fishing? Yes, absolutely. Yes. So shore fishing is a very very high pressure. <laughs> yes, so tough in Japan. In Japan shore fishing is a very tough but so sometimes help my experience so sometimes elite many anglers throw on the same spot fish no bite bait too much pressure so but too much pressure is a very good for me so sabine river is a very tough good for me so sometimes help in the shore fishing experience so Always, I, I fish in the U.S., but like a Japanese trash fishing. Finesse, throw, stay, small mass too. So day four, a day two, day one, day two, day three, day four. So all sometimes so fish nervous. But almost so always I throw on the bait and the fin the bottom and the shake, 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 shake. But Fish nervous, shake, shake, no bite. I cast on a bait, fill in the bottom, so stay in a 10 second, 15 second, and a little bit shake, stop, waiting, bite. So if fish is tough, so good for me. So shore fishing experiences, very, very help, help for me. How long will you leave a cast? Like, what was your longest cast there? From when you made the cast till mm -hmm. you got the bait back to the boat. How long did you work the uh, bait? Like, how long? How many minutes? Ten minutes. For one cast? It's, yes. Oh, my goodness. Yes, sometimes it's so 20 feet deep weightless bait I use. So 20 feet deep weightless bait, cast, waiting. Feel in the bottom, throw, throw, throw. So sometimes, so 
very, very long time, one cast. So maybe Sabine is uh, five minutes, four minutes, I think. So because the 10 feet, 10 feet deep, weight rest on the shade, wait it, wait it. So maybe five minutes, one cast, five minutes. You will throw a weightless bait in 10 feet and 20 feet of water, a weightless bait? Yes, always, always. Wow. Because tough, so high pressure, high pressure bass don't like weight. Don't like weight. Throw forward lab, throw action lab. So I usually, every, every tournament, I tie on a weightless bait. Yeah, super tough. I try to wait rest bait. Yeah, top secret Japanese techniques. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, many, many to so take a time, need a time. It's a very, very hard. So, but sure fisherman always stay in the same spot. I can wait. I can wait in uh, five minutes, ten minutes. But boat fishermen. Always fishing a trolling motor, trolling motor, cannot wait. So taku in Japan, many times shore fishing. I can wait. I can sleep. <laughs> 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 taku, when when do you go home? How often? I mean, you have a beautiful wife, a son. But when when do you see them? I know that they're not here right now, yeah. are they? <laughs> yes. Yeah, so stay in Japan. So I will go back August 15th. And uh, so now July 2021. So maybe I hope next year's Bassmasters pre-practice. So I want to pre-practice. Yes. So, but so I don't know next year's so schedule. I wait in uh, Bassmaster ED schedule and I will go to the Bassmaster Classic for practice oh so i think the schedule comes out like today this week oh, i think really? you get oh, the yeah. schedule yeah oh, yeah so yeah so, so as soon as you get the schedule you're gonna pick some lakes and then go pre-practice them yeah yeah absolutely yes yes how many I, I, days do you spend on a body of water you, like if when i mean how much time do you get to spend on, on outside of the actual pre-fish that everyone does? Do you always go beforehand? Yes. Yeah, so Taku always alone in U.S. Every day alone. I every day pre-practice. Many kind of break and I learn to fishing and I check the graph every day. So I I want to uh, so many many practice. I I love so because I want to want to lead. So I, every day, no no so no rest time. Every day fishing concentrate, fishing concentrate practice tournament practice tournament. Every day so this uh, very very hard but. So Bassmaster Elite sure is my dream. I can't do that. Everyday fishing, concentrate fishing. Hard to be away from your family, I imagine. You miss yeah. your family a lot. Yeah, very, very hard. Very, very hard. So I need to spend the Japanese of my family. So but but so but so Bassmaster Elite is the biggest, biggest dream for me. So I can do that. Yeah. What well, what did they say after you won when you talked to them on the phone? What what did they say? Uh, oh, congratulations! I <laughs> want to hold, but maybe my song cannot hold too heavy. Taku, Taku cannot hold. My song six years old, maybe cannot hold. I think together, maybe. Uh, yeah, together, maybe I can. I can. Do, yeah, we can do that. <laughs> you you claimed. Earlier in the week, I thought you were just joking when you told me you could talk to smallmouth. But mm -hmm. after winning and everything you did, maybe you can talk to the smallmouth. You think you can talk to smallmouth? 
Yes, I can do this. I can I can speak to small mass. So because small mass can speak Japanese, it's a very <laughs> easy for me. Japanese is the, is the every day I use. So my first language Japanese, second language is English. So small mass I think a first language is Japanese. So taku first language Japanese, small mass first language Japanese. I can I can talk to small mass. So. How have you learned English so good? To, I mean, it is amazing when I first met you. Do you remember when we first met? We met at a meeting in Birmingham. And, yeah, and I remember I that. You were with your wife, right? And yes, she, yes, yes. she did 90% of the talking, you know, because, <laughs> because you, were, you didn't speak very good English yeah. at the time. And now Waddington loved you. I, I mean, you speak such good English on the stage. How have you learned such good English? Oh, thank you very much. So I'm very happy. So, so I, I, every day alone in US, I have to talk to you. So English. Yeah. So, and uh, I, I love, I love English. I like English. Uh, so high school, university. So I study in English. I like it. So. I learn, but but so Japanese I learn English, English, but different in the U.S. English. So native U.S. English, Japanese I learn English are different. Yeah. So first time I can speak very well, but I spend the uh, U.S. in the two years, three maybe so it is the two year, two year I I spend the U.S. So. My ear is a very, some very good. I can understand so many people say something, so I can understand. I I can talk this, so it's a very good. But some sometimes so difficult, sometimes difficult. But so I think uh, so Michigan, New York, so Canada, so sometimes up, so upper side. Yeah, the northern part. English, northern English is a very good for me, <laughs> but so sometimes I, I so sometimes so Alabama English is a very difficult. Gerald Swindle, hard to understand. <laughs> yes, I love Gerald Swindle. I love Gerald Swindle, but sometimes so difficult. So I love West Rogan. I like West Rogan, but sometimes difficult to, to so understand. So. But yes. northern, northern U.S. so very good, good for me. So very clear, yeah. But, yeah. But I love Gerald. I love West. Yeah. Many anglers love Takumi. You are very popular with all the anglers. Um, I mean, you have so many great relationships. When you won, Brandon Polnick jumped up on the stage to hug you. Tell me about your friendship with 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 Brandon. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm very happy. So I, I love, so it's a tournament. It's a competitor all around. So all, all longer fishing concentrate, but no water. I, I think um, all, so I love US people. I love, so Bassmaster Elite Angra. Out of the water, Yeah. I hope, so friends. So Brandon Paranyuk is a very good guy. Taku always only. So sometimes Brandon texts me, if you need help, so call me. So I always alone. I always something to travel. Yes. So I, I got so because alone, <laughs> oh, 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 it's trouble. <laughs> so sometimes happen, but Brandon, he, he's busy. He He's very popular. The yes. fishing, so many shooting, but so hey Taku, are you okay? So sometimes call me, sometimes text me. He he so help very very good very good help. For very me. good person. Yeah, so so good guy. So many okay. many good people on the elite series. Ma many yeah, good yeah, people. Yeah. Many good people. So tournament is a concentrated fishing, but out of the water. Many people is a very awesome guy. Crack went around awesome. So I love US, US. So Bassmaster Edith, 
Angra. What What is the hardest thing about chasing this dream? Every dream, no matter what your dream is, it always comes with sacrifices and there's always some bad. What What is the What is the toughest part about living over in the U.S. and chasing this dream? What is What is hard for you? Oh, uh -huh. so I think uh, so very very hard to get got a visa. Visa, visa yes, uh, yeah, and uh, so uh, house, so housing and visa and, and everything. House is yeah. a very hard now. So my friend Michigan John, so fishing now open together fishing. So he stay in he stay in Michigan. My friend John. So uh -huh. John always helped me. So John's cousin stay in Georgia. My I I can stay in Georgia now. It's a very very good. So help for me. So maybe I I tack only tack only cannot fishing in U.S. So U.S. people is a very, very kind. So I fish in a concentrate. So many anglers watching me. Some so always helping help me. So I can fish in the Bassmaster Elite. Many U.S. people help Taku. So I can fishing. So many kind of many. So so kind. Yes. U.S. people is a kind. So Taku can fish in in US. So many kind of people is helping me. I can do that. Thankful for those people. Thankful for yeah, those people. Thank you very much. I appreciate the app. So if Taku does not make this dream, if you were not a pro fisherman, let's just say, what do you think you'd be doing today if you did not come to America to fish bass tournaments? What what would you be doing today? What would your job be today? Yes, if you were, if you if you never came to America to fish, if you couldn't follow your dream, if you if you stayed in Japan, uh, would you still still be working in the fishing industry? Yeah, maybe. So, I think uh, maybe. So I'm. So my dream is a not a U.S. tournament. Maybe in Japan, stay in Japan. I think, but but but, I love so on, not only fishing. So U.S. U.S. history, I love. U.S. car, I love. So I think, uh, so I think if no fishing, my right, maybe I will go to the U. I I, I will go to the U.S. Maybe so because I love U.S. Yeah. history, yes, U.S. car, the many kind of so maybe. Maybe I I want to go to the U.S. I think. What what, what hey Taco? What kind of music do you listen to? So, what what mean? kind of music do you like? Do what you listen to music? Do you dance? Ah yes, I love it. I love it. I love U.S. music. So hip hop, so many kind of so U.S. Mu music. I love it. You like hip hop? Yeah, I like hip hop. So sometimes. So I, I, so I listen to many, many kind of genre, but I like maybe in the university, the 17, 18, 19 years old. So U.S. hip hop, I love it. Well, did, did you, do you dance? Do you dance to U.S. <laughs> hip hop or no dance? No dance, no dance, no dance. But I, I, so I so drive the car every time. So I. I enjoy the music. Music turned up and listening to it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So when you're not fishing, what do you do? What What does Takumi Ito, when there's no fishing, you have a day off, you're going to have fun. What do you do? Uh, but you can't go fishing and you're going to go have fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Taku is a very... So rare. So maybe... No tournament, no tournament, no fishing. No so fishing. I will go to the enjoy fishing. So I think I enjoy fishing. Only fishing. Tackle oh. only fishing. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> only fishing. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think. Yeah. No dancing, no skateboarding. 
No, nothing. Uh, just fishing. Just fishing. So summer fishing, winter fishing. Taku the crazy. Everyday fishing. <laughs> yeah. So so I don't know why, but I love I love fishing. So in US, everyday fishing. In Japan, everyday fishing. So photo shoot, video shoot, many, many fishing, fishing in Japan, but holiday. Go to together my friend fishing. Fishing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why, but I love fishing every day. Every day. Yeah. Is that one of the most important characteristics to make it to win? Do you think to just be obsessed with fishing, just all fishing all the time? Is that one of the most important things for a pro angler? <laughs> One more, please. Sorry. Is, is loving fishing, is being yeah. obsessed by fishing, always wanting to fish, mm -hmm. is that one of the most important things for a pro angler to have? If you don't yeah. have that, yeah. it's still good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I I respect, I always respect So Clark Wendrand. Yes. Clark Wendrand is a tournament, is concentrated the practice. So sunlight 30 minutes ago, fishing. Sunset 30 minutes later, fishing, Clark Wendron. So he's 55 years old, but he concentrate practice. He, he always so concentrated the tournament. It's a very, very, very important for me because I respect the Clark Wendron. I, so I, same things, always concentrate tournament. Sun, sunlight 30 minutes ago, I fish. Before 30 minutes, fish. Sunset 30 minutes later, fishing end. I'm tired, I'm alone, and uh, eat uh, something, work, so go to the bathroom, and the shower, the sleep. So not enough to sleep, but concentrate fishing is a very, very important because the heart, so everyone want to get to a blue trophy. Everyone want want to win a tournament, but Clark is a so strong concentration. Haku, so I respect always Clark. Same things, always concentrate. It's a very important for me. Very focused, very concentrated. Yes. You're yes. You're always working, whether you're on the water, wherever I see, you're always working on tackling. You're never, you're never not focused on fishing. Yeah, always, always fishing. Yeah. It, this, this, this dream, this amazing dream. When you go back to Japan, what do you have any plans? What do you do? Will there be a party? What, what will you do when you go back to Japan <laughs> with the trophy, and who will carry the trophy? <laughs> so hopefully, so. Maybe maybe come back to Japan. So I I have too many photo shoot, video shoot. So very very every day that maybe in a so busy day. But but so maybe so I so I photo shoot, video shoot. I concentrate fishing too, and I will try to so stretch stretch so. I can hold alone, so I will try. So if so, I August 15, I I go back to Japan, and uh, maybe December I came back here. So I, I'm a maybe powerful. I can hold alone. When you come back, big muscles, big <laughs> yeah, muscles. Yeah, yeah. Muscle. I need the muscles because <laughs> I have no muscles. <laughs> <laughs> On one arm you can get taco, and the other one you can get time. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. Taku time was a big thing this weekend. What does taku time mean to you? Yeah, taku time is a so taku strong time. So small mass, small mass love taku time, fever time, like uh, small mass dancing, small mass, small mass. So taku here, taku time is here. <laughs> so much many coming, 
and the water 100 500 hack time it's a very very fun very very fun time maybe the one hour two hour three hour only one hour two hour hack time but small mouth feeding at the tuck time is a very very important it's a very very important and a very very good time and uh... yeah 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 good time 105 pounders love tuck time so did you at least go buy a big dinner or something after you won did you go out for a celebration dinner with sego or something uh yes yeah, so my so rental house so outside i cooking a steak i myself nice grilling them yeah so i need a uh, muscle so i every day eat a steak so, <laughs> yeah, so winning day i I cook in a steak and today cook in a steak too. I so did. You went fishing yesterday, right? Baffy, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, fishing. Yeah, fishing. Oh, what did the small mouth say to you yesterday? Uh, yesterday, the, so I will go to the Taku Disneyland two town, two town. So small mouth kids, kids town. I will. So. Oh. Little this ones. Land, kids down. Many, many one pounder. But I found, found many one pounder come in my boat. So my Disneyland is uh, so kids time. <laughs> yeah, Good. Yeah, yeah. But that's okay. Kids are allowed to come the day after you win. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Kids is so fun. Easy. I, I, so I love two pounder, three pounder. So because so five pounder, six pounder, the too much power, too much power. So I always so use the trolling motor and the chasing. So and the five pounder mouse is a very, very so fat. So small. So kid is a easy to hook up. Yes. But five pounder, six pounder, very hard for me hook up. So. I love two pounder, three pounder. So, <laughs> so enjoy fishing. I I try the one pounder, two pounder, three pounder. It's easy for me. Co Corey Johnson wishes that the the kids had showed up on Sunday. He 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 would he, he would have rather you catch those two and three pounders on Sunday. Oh really? I love it. <laughs> <laughs> when you would hook fish, you would you would. I mean, we heard you talking to the fish, telling them to go deep, go deep. But you would, you would try yeah. lead them away to deeper water, basically. Correct? Yeah. So my super technique, my super small mouth technique, is a go deep, go deep, because <coughs> small mouth. So I learn. I I fish every day. I learn small mouth. So powerful, quick speed, quick swimming, but no. So no, so they cannot swim in the long time. They cannot swim in the long time. So no stamina. Swimming, swimming fast, but no stamina. So yes. and uh, small mass, many times jumping, jumping. So jump is a very, very so dangerous time for me. Yes. So hook out, break the line. So small mass go deep and swimming. And I chase, all the time chase the boat. And uh, small mass tired, small mass tired, no jump coming up. And I catch. So I hook set, drug is very hard. Hook set is a drug, drug is very hard. But so loose, 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 loose and drag and let them yeah, swim. Loose and drag and the small mass hopefully go deep. And I always chase in the boat, throwing motor I use, chasing the boat and the small mass tired, easy to catch. But so hard to, hard to fight, small mass jump, 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 no good. I use the right line. I use a finesse line, so no good jump. So I hook set and uh, 
no fight, no fight. Stalking, tattoo stalking. Did so, you learn? Did you learn that through practicing? Like, did did you uh, learn that through just catching a lot of them over time? Now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Last year, last year, Saint Clair Island. Okay, okay. Small mass, no stamina. Small mass, swimming hard, but no stamina. I I use a six pounds sometimes. So hard to drag the hook set, loose and drag, and I need a time. Yeah, so Saint Clair and Ontario is a, so almost all nothing to so tree stand yeah. so dangerous spot so I can do that, but Lake Fork many tree many stand, I can't do that so no good for no good for me <laughs> yeah. You told Jake your camera person when you went out in the lake. You told Jake last year. Mm -hmm. I was scared when you went out. Last, when you when you talked to Jake before you mm -hmm. went out on the last day to the lake, you said last year when we went out here, I was yeah. scared. Yeah, 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 yeah. Taku's yeah. not scared anymore. Did you yeah. practice driving in the rough in the big water in the? Uh, so yes. Yeah, so last, I I I will try to practice in the rough water driving. And so last year, so I'm scared. I cannot go to the lake last day, but so get the blue trophy. No scare. Taku cannot scare. So I I so concentrate. So I wanna fishing the lake. I wanna fishing the lake. So I can I can go to the big wave. So I can do that now. It's so in Japan the no so rough water. Nothing. So tag first time Ontario's wave last year. Ah, no good, no good. I cannot, <laughs> I cannot go. But this year, tag is strong. I can do. I can go to the Lake Ontario. I can go to the Lake Ontario. So I can go to. I think I'm learning, and I think the entire fishing world is learning. With yeah. concentration, there's nothing that Takumi Ito can't do. You're an amazing, amazing person, an amazing angler. And I thank you for committing to our sport and going through with everything you did to come here. Because I really think when you watch how that audience acted with you in Waddington and you just look at how people talked about, you inspired, you inspired future generations. And, and I said it to you on stage and I'll say it again, Takumi, you may have beaten Hank Parker in a video game, and that's what inspired you. Yeah. One day, a kid is going to play a video game, and he's yeah. going to try to beat Takumi Ito. Because yeah. I'm going to tell you, you're going to be on a video game, and, and what you've done in this sport is amazing. Congratulations, and thank you, Takumi. Thank you very much, Dave. I'm very good, good time. I, I'm very happy, so thank you very much. Do taco time dance with me. Can you do a dance? <laughs> Come on, everybody. You should be a better dancer, no? Sorry? This is no dancing. There's no dancing, right? No <laughs> dancing? No dancing? Uh, small mass dancing. You're not so. dancing. <laughs> taco dancing? No taco, taco dancing? Taco dancing? So what? Play? Please, please teach me dancing. Would, would you dance? Would you would, give me one of these? Oh, my goodness. Look at the rhythm you have. Taco. <laughs> See how good you are learning good, just good. like that. Good. You became a better dancer than me. <laughs> <laughs> Takumi Ito, thank you for everything you bring to this industry and congratulations. Um, and we'll talk to you soon. Talk to you soon. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thanks, Takumi. Thank you. That dude right there, that dude is one amazing individual. He is just an amazing human being. And if that didn't inspire you, if that didn't motivate you to go out there, you know, no matter what boundaries stand in your way, people are always saying, well, if I had this, if I had that, you're talking about somebody who has hostaged everything in his life and is focused on one thing as you saw. I mean, I taught him how to dance. He doesn't even dance. <laughs> he, uh, he just wants to fish and he wants to make it. And that's the amazing thing about people, no matter what country you're from, no matter where you're from, that's 
the Bassmaster dream, and you look at all the amazing things that have been accomplished the last few weeks on the Elite Series, whether it be <clears throat> Brian Schmidt's first Elite Series win on Champlain, Takumi Ito's win just a few days ago, um, Josh Trasner winning Rookie of the Year, Seth Fighter winning Angler of the Year. They're all obsessed. They're all driven. They're all committed to conquering and mastering something that can't be mastered, and that's fish, and it changes every single day. And they're all different people. They all come from different parts of the world, but they all have that same drive and love and commitment, and that's what it takes to make it in this sport. And Takumi Ito, thank you for doing this show. You are an, an amazing inspiration. And the crazy thing is I think – Takumi's just getting started. But we're not. That's it. That's all I got for you on this show. This has been Mercer. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you next week. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Because Bob Cobb of the Bassmaster told you to. You hear?